Hello everyone, welcome back to my video. Today I want to show you my Asian pear trees here. These trees are three years old. This year it is providing so much fruit. Oh, I try my pen. So much fruit, tom tom. They're not quite ready yet. Um, the fruits are still growing. They will get bigger. But I just want to show you how much fruits that uh, it's giving me this year. I have not pruned it yet. There were lots of um, bad ones earlier in the spring, and I pull out all the bad ones off. The one that has like orange rust and stuff on it. And then I left the rest, the good ones. And I apply now that I mean, mean sat like that. I mean that I um, go home, go home. Do the cow no lợn, nhom yo, nhom bách chén ở linh. I took the lợn lợn. So this is one tree, and then any this side, this one right here. At đám ni, this is my other pear tree, as well. I bought two, three years ago when we just moved to the house and it is giving so much fruit I'm so happy, I'm very happy I water this tree once once a day every day if there's no rain I water it but if we have rain I don't water it so it's getting higher taller and if you look over here I am trying to propagate more trees from the branches I have one that's starting I started this one last year um, using yeah, this is two more that I started not that long ago. Hopefully it take roots. Hey baby. I got my little girl right here waiting for the fruits to be ripe. <laughs> she is she's been getting some off the branches. I don't blame her. Asian pears are delicious. My oh, law maintain. So happy. Law oh, bump on. We did a good job. They're getting bigger. Yeah. Last year they were probably half that size. Uh -oh, yeah. Japanese beetle. Yeah, but um, I was saying I think next year we should. Start prune, pruning it. yeah, prune it because yeah. they don't they don't encourage you to prune it after before three year. And uh, this is coming the third year now, so I want him to start pruning the top part. Yeah. Uh, we, keep it bright, keep it actually, low. I think it's, we're three years in now because we, yeah, we're we bought three the year. house in fall of um, 2019. Right. And so we planted this in the spring of 2020, and it's now the summer of 2020. Yeah. So it's been three years. It's so. been three years, so we need so to. So this, this fall. We'll prune it back. Yeah, you're supposed to prune it anyway. So because you want, do you want the the middle to spread like a V shape, and then the branches spread out. So there, there that way the sun will hit on the inside of the tree, and it'll produce more fruits for you. Well, and one of the reasons, well, there's a couple of reasons why you prune. So for starters, it helps control the size of the plant, right? Like it doesn't allow the tree to get way big and out of control. Uh, but also, when you when you prune it, it that makes the plant switch from trying to send the nutrients to the new established branches to make them grow and strengthen and so on and so forth to shifting its energies to its fruit. And then that's one of the mm -hmm. ways that you'll get more and larger fruit. Right. And right. so we haven't been pruning at all um, just because it's, it hasn't it's, reached the three, third year three yet. Years, yeah. right? But now that it's it's been in there three years, the, the tree, I mean, when we first planted this, it was if, twig. You, if you go back in, the, in in our archives of videos, I mean, I think the tree was like this tall mm. or so. I don't I don't think it was taller than I was. If it was, it was the size very, of the, it was the size of yeah, my, I mean, it was, it was, my uh, 
persimmon tree right now. The, the, right. the, the it was, tree it was over a there. Sapling or seedling, however you want to call it, that we bought. And now in three years' time, I mean, you can see this. Yeah, it's taller than my husband. 15 feet tall. It's the tallest yeah. branch up there, at least. Yeah. And so now is the time of going, okay, well, now we're going to start shaping it, controlling this growth. Because one of the, the big things with uh, fruit trees, too, if you have a 35, 40 foot tall fruit tree, you're not going to reach the fruit at the top. Nope. You, you have know? to use ladder, and that, it's so inconvenient. Right. And so these trees were, I mean, they're, they're dwarf trees anyway, so they shouldn't get much more than about 15, 20 feet. So now when we start pruning off the tops of those branches, we can start shaping it, controlling it how we want it to be for ease of uh, picking the fruit, but then also encouraging it to produce more and larger fruits. Well, if you go to the orchard, all the trees are, are not tall at all. Yeah. They're 15, 20. About 15, 20. Yeah. But... What I was going to say too is, I mean, because we started, we actually started getting fruits on these trees the first year we planted, mm -hmm. uh, but, but not they, this but much. They were though. small. They were they were little, tiny, almost the size of cherries, and they they typically weren't fully developed. They were were, were always had spots. Infected, they had all, yeah. all kinds of problems, which that's why you don't eat those fruit. Um, you don't expect to start really getting fruit that you can third eat year until yeah. the third year. Well, last year we got some good ones, but not this many. Yeah, and and, now. and they weren't as big as these. Yeah. You know, and so now these things are going to continue to get bigger because you if you figure from like the grocery store, the standard Asian pear is like this. Mm -hmm. It's like the size of a softball, you know, mm -hmm. and this is far from that. It's maybe the a third next of the month. Size. Next month, I think it's going to get bigger. It's still growing. It's not yeah. ready yet. But they're definitely I mean, they're they're probably double the size that we got last year and probably 10 times the size from the first year. So. And the amount is significantly more as well. So yeah. Yeah, I was telling them that I wanted to get more trees, so I started propagating. <laughs> I started air laying. Yeah, air laying. Air laying. You just have to be patient. It, oh, 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 oh my god! Oh, oh zooming! Oh, that was, oh, oh my goodness! What caused you? What, what caused you? Yeah, what caused you to do that? That's so cute though. You can do more if you want. You can zoom me for mommy. Oh, what the? <laughs> My goodness. What, what's going on, baby? What's going on? Hmm? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Just don't let mommy over. <laughs> you getting the itch? Are you getting the itch? Yeah? She's tired. She's tired. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I'm also excited because last year we were getting what appeared to be a lot of blight, you know, where the. the oh. The tree, the leaves will look like they, they get burned, actually. They yeah, I, I, I broke it off. Yeah, I broke all, the stem off. That's all you can do is whenever yeah. you see it, you just you have to just break it off and hope that it doesn't spread. spread. Yeah. No, I broke it off. I mean, there's one branch that was all beetle, black. Japanese beetle here. Yeah, that was all black. And I just broke that branch off and tossed it like yeah. away. Burned the darn thing because <laughs> it's going to come back. So if you see black spot on the branches, just and rip it off. The leaves, on the, yeah. And you just take it off. And they can see because this is what we got a lot of the first year of. Yeah. A little shriveled up, couldn't produce nothing kind of stuff. Yeah. The black burn uh, leaves. Yeah, it looks like something like a leaf that burned. That's a little bit of blight. And so, and you definitely want to, don't let it see if it's going to heal itself. You yeah. Because it won't. It'll spread and it'll end up killing the tree. Yep. All right. Well, just want to share our beautiful trees here. Our beautiful Asian pear trees. Excited to harvest the fruits next year, uh, in a month, actually, <laughs> not next year, in a month. I'm glad that we bought the, the pear trees because it is just beautiful here. It adds, it adds um, beauty to it. In the springtime, I get beautiful blossoms, and then in the summertime, you know, it provides shades, and it's just gorgeous when it's fruiting as well. สบายใจมั้ยเต้นบางปอนเหมือนบ้านดําดําเพียร์ดําสรีดอกดอกให้มินออยแพลนึงจะทักเออ maybe uh next month
ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ตัวนี้ต